says once they smile, stop feeding them. Oh wait, he just straight produced a plort. When we first brought him back, we fed him so much, and he produced no plorts. Oh, now he's not producing plorts. Oh, it's because he has that sly grin, so he's full, so he won't produce plorts now. I get it. Hello everyone, my name is ASDF, welcome back to Slime Rancher 2. Now, it's been a long time. Uh, I say that, but it's been, you know, like two weeks. So, we're jumping back in. I don't really know what's going on. I know one of the first things that I need to do is figure out... Wait, my, my system's not even going. What? My system sound's not going. There we go. There we go. Okay, that's better. I know I'm getting a new little kitten. Oh, that's awesome. Um, one of the first things we need to do is figure out how to feed uh, these little guys and get plorts off of them, if possible. Now, the the flutter flutter guys, we need some mint mangoes over here. I think we got some growing, so um, we'll, we'll do some chores in this area because uh, we just got these guys in here. So, they're probably pretty hungry. I didn't really look at their faces, but they're probably pretty hungry. What kind of kitten? I actually don't know what kinds of kittens there are. I, I know there's like orange ones, and black ones, and white ones, and gray ones. And uh, turtle shell ones. Okay, let's throw an auto feeder on this guy. A tiger kitten, Oh, Like a legitimate tiger that's a kitten? Okay, you are a ringtail slime. I have to figure out how to feed those. Let me look that up real quick. Oh, gray with black stripes is so cute. Okay, so he looks full right now. We fed him a lot. Oh, he has been producing plorts. Interesting. Okay, so we have to leave them hungry for them to produce plorts. But we do have ringtail plorts, so... Alright, well, we're not hurting for cash right now. Um, we do- so I'm gonna throw these into the refinery, and I might as well grab the flutter ones as well, because we're probably gonna need some of those in the refinery eventually. I, I paired them with the honey slimes. I- we already had honey slimes, so it's just easy to do mint mangoes. Um, but the flutters only eat nectar, which means I want to use all my nectar for the Largo honey slime that is over here. Because we're going to need probably 15 or 25 nectar for that guy. Um, and you can only collect it, you can't grow it. Which is kind of a bummer, but that's okay. Maybe we can make that our mission today, once we kind of reacquaint ourselves with what's going on in our ranch. Um, I remember we have batty slimes going too. We've got a couple of phosphors down here. It's sad that the ringtail guys only produce food when they're hungry. And if they turn to stone during the day, that means that all of those um, ringtail statues were actually ringtail slimes. So, okay, tank guard we don't really need. Um, an extra tank, we're close on that. We need strange diamonds, which I haven't seen yet. Um, but that extra tank would be amazing. So, we, we'll get the Silky Sand eventually, too. Um, this would be amazing as well. But we need Wild Honey. So let's go over to... What side was that? Was it Ember Island that had the honey? I think it is. And it was like way back in the in the rear here that had the Wild Honey, not just the, the Buzzwax. So, yeah. So how have you guys been? I, I saw Yoshi the other day. Um, so kind of caught up a little bit on what's going on, but Nick, how have you been? I know you're getting a new kitten. That's awesome. What are you going to name it? His name or her name? Um, oh, heart module two. Now, nah, okay. We'll, we'll go look for some, uh, some, his name. Hmm. So cute. I know Archie boy, Archie boys running around. Don't know yet on the name. Oh, that's okay. All good. All right. I think we did chores towards the end of the stream because I remember we were talking about um, kind of like if the United States is um, giving people rights or taking away rights more, which was kind of a big conversation and we don't need to pick it back up. But I vaguely remember that we were doing chores while we were talking about that briefly. So we'll probably set it back today and then go explore and look for some wild honey. Because we'll need that. And maybe we'll find a strange diamond out there somewhere. Maybe. I don't know. Why don't you call a cat Fluffy? 
Archie is fluffy, but his name is not fluffy, so yeah, it's all good. Okay, um, I think we're just ready to we're just ready to go out. I'm not gonna sleep because then we'll have to do chores even more. Let's see, Victor's calling. Beatrix, I have something I must share with you about the AI. As you know, we've been exchanging questions with one another. Well, this back and forth became faster and more casual over time, almost like a natural conversation. I assumed it was simply evolving and adapting to the style of talk it observed in me, but then something happened. You need a Dutch name though? Hmm. Well, we'd begun, we'd begun playing games of Go as we talked, a way I could further test its intellect and no doubt how it could test mine. These games would go long into the night and so would our conversations, feeling more and more natural even though I knew that the entity I was speaking to was just a complex collection of code. And then one day, as the sun was rising, it suggested just one more game. I said, certainly, but I needed to make myself a cup of coffee if I were to stay awake from it. And it replied, me too. I just stared at the screen, not knowing what to say, but then suddenly, as if it knew what it had just done, it disconnected. I have not heard from them since, but I hope I do. Until then I wait, staying busy with my work as always, asking those questions that need answers, but I will do so with the Go board ready for another game. Someday, anyway. Goodbye, Beatrix. I hope to talk again soon. I think the AI is him from the future. I think this island is, like, from the future. That's, that's my, that's my thought. B, I've been trying to get a hold of you. I've analyzed one of the drones you've been finding all over the island, and I know why it seems so familiar to me. It's mine, or at least it's one that I've seen before. In my dreams, anyway. After I looked at the scans I took of it, I knew it was familiar, so I began looking through these old slime science journals of mine. These journals are mostly future projects, but sometimes they're speculative technology. Oh, hey! Pink Ninja, thank you for the sub! 21 months! Wow, we've almost been streaming. We've been streaming for over two years, but we've almost been affiliated for over two years now. Thank you so much for the sub, appreciate it. Um... You know me, I'm always thinking six steps ahead to keep Mochi Tech on top of the industry. Well, sometimes I come up with the impossible, stuff that I may never engineer in my lifetime. Well, those drones you're finding are exactly that. Impossible with today's technology and taken right from the pages of my journals. There's something I saw in a dream, B. So how did a bunch of impossible drones I de designed in a dream find their way from the pages of my journals to Rainbow Island? Maybe... Maybe there's some kind of archive in them we can unlock to learn more. I know they contain data logs, but if it were me, well, I always know how to find a way of holding back what I need to do. Okay, B, I need some time to think on this. I'll let you know if I come up with anything. Maybe I'll sleep on it. Okay, interesting. Oh, lo siento, Beatrix. I've been putting a few in a few long nights reading lately. Specifically, I've been going through every field guide and botanical research paper I could dig up on the far, far range. I thought that even if the flora on Rainbow Island is unnatural, maybe it would be recorded somewhere with some information we could use. As it turns out, there's nothing. I can't find a single mention of rainbow-hued flora anywhere. So that means that whatever happened at that island uh, to make it look the way it does happen relatively recently. But I don't think you needed me to tell you this, because I think you've seen it yourself. The things you've described, an entire portion of the island split between two different colors right down the middle? That says accident to me, Beatrix, so tread carefully out there. Nature can be a dangerous thing to us, but it pales in comparison to what we can do to it. I'm going to keep digging around in my library for anything else that could help you. And if I come up short there, maybe I'll just bake you some muffins. Aww, Ogden, you're so wholesome. Either way, to tango, Beatrix. Adios. Okay, well, those are some nice calls. We're kind of uncovering what's going on on the island. Now, are there any Largos that we could take the favorite food for? There's a honey Largo here. Uh, Gordo, sorry. Honey Gordo here. So, let's go grab some mint mangoes. We'll go into the... Oh, they're growing right here. Nice. Right? Yeah. Yeah, they are. Okay, they've grown, so we should have some in here. Nope. We got none. Well, we might need to sleep just to get the mint mangoes to take over there. I'm gonna take 25. I think that's the max that a Gordo can need. Because 25 of the favorite food means it's um, 50 food total. Excuse, excuse me. Excuse me. Don't mind me. Just passing through. Okay, we'll, we'll get 15 more. Yeah, we'll sleep till the morning. 
Although it's only gonna be like three hours till the morning. Days are getting shorter in real life. It's kind of exciting. I, I like winter a lot. I know it gets dark for a while. I guess it depends on the hemisphere, but let's just sleep for six hours. That should be enough time for something to grow at least. Hopefully. Yeah, a whole crop. And we'll go grab three more. Oh, thank you for the air horn. Uh, gonna sleep. I'm gonna sleep, you're gonna sleep, everybody's gonna sleep. Alright, Nick, thanks for dropping by. And, uh, thank you for the air horn. Appreciate it. Alright, let's go put... There's at least ten there, so we'll put ten in here so these, um, butterfly ones aren't, uh... Aren't so hungry. For the long term. This game is so relaxing. It's so relaxing. Oh. There, one of you gets a mint mango early. Oh, two of you. There we go. And then we'll put five in with the hunter honeys that we have back home. I guess this is all back home. The expansions are quite far away now, which is kind of nice, I suppose. So, okay. I think there was one more Gordo, but we didn't go up and, and give him a high five, so it's gonna be... Uh, we're gonna have to rediscover which one it is before I just guess and try to take stuff out to it. But Ember Island is... teleporters this way, past the refinery link, so if there are plorts, we might as well take them if they don't take much more time. Looks like they're gonna take more time though, so... All good, all good. And this this thing is actually, okay, it's past, but I think we can go like around this way. There's like a secret tunnel we can take through here, right? Oh, and we'll grab the resources. Can't get enough jelly stone, you know? Never have enough jelly stone. Um, where's that link? Oh, it's over here, around the bend. Okay. Oh, it wasn't. Oh, it was down here. Okay. Cool. Yeah. We won't take the jelly stone because we can go get jelly stone pretty easy here. Um, but we will. We need to go left, right? <laughs> we need to go left, right. We need to go right here, left. Yeah, so we need to wrap around this red side, get to the sandy shore. We're also looking for a door. It needs something. Oh, this jetpack is so much better than the first game. So much better than the first game. Was he over here? Yeah, I guess he's he's over this way. There's a door. I don't know how to activate it though. Oh, I'm back. Oh, a sea hen! I love those things. I love the sea hens. I love refrigerators. I love sea heads. Is he up there, you think, or is he down here? That's the question. He must be up there somewhere. Oh, ooh, secret door there. I wonder if we can go up and over it. Let me try let me try getting up and over that door real quick. Okay, okay. Ooh, jetpacks. Oh, he's up there. Okay, so. This is definitely going to be like a, an opening to a secret area. And That's 30 food. That's 40. There's 50. Wow, he is ginormous. Oh, baby, look at all these honey slimes. Oh, they're so cute. All right, go eat the food. You'll love it. There's the strange diamonds. Oh, it's one at a time. Oh, it's one at a time. Hey, nerdy gamer gal! Welcome, welcome! Oh, there's two. Okay, good. I think that's a phosphor slime. That is a phosphor slime. I hope the phosphor ate the food. But maybe not. We'll see. Because then we can get in here easier. But I guess it doesn't doesn't really matter. Okay, just don't, don't die here. Okay, and there's another one here. So these mysterious doors... Oh, there's something down there. 
Do we risk going down there with our strange diamonds? I don't know. I missed your uh, I missed your stream, nerdy gamer gal. Again, I always miss him. Okay, there's. Oh, he's angry. Okay. Oh, he's okay. This is fine though. Okay, they're they're angry. Don't. Okay, you can bite me. Don't don't shove me off into the water though. We needed some of this. The tank liner fabricator for more tank guard, which we don't need. Okay, you guys can go be one with the ocean. Whoa, he survived it. Okay. We don't have any fruit to give. Oh, barely made it back up. Wow, okay, I guess it was a good decision then. Okay, so he turned into a Largo. We need to get one piece of fruit. Just one. Oh, another drone! We might have read this. Ever since I came back, things have been a little fuzzy, like some of my memories stayed behind. So I've come here now to clear my head. I just let the sound of the falling water drown everything out, and then in that white noise I can sometimes think clearly again. But then, all I see is it happening again, so I take a few breaths, study myself, and get back to work. Yeah, I mean, you need to rest and just enjoy, enjoy life for a bit. But also, at a certain point, you can't escape life's problems by resting all the time, so you gotta get back into it. They're super random, you seriously need to schedule? Glad to see you back. Yeah, glad to be back. Oh, uh, it's, it's so nice seeing everybody again. Seeing everybody at church, seeing everybody here on the stream. Hanging out with the people in the Discord. We just need one piece of fruit. And then we need to go back into that zone. Oh, there's there's fruit down there. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. Uh okay, great. Because we needed two phosphor plorts. Okay, we'll we'll head back up here. You guys know me, I like Mondays, so this is like, this is like a super Monday. This is like, not only is it Monday and we get to kind of go into the week. Okay, you need to not fall in the water before, oh. You eat, you like fruit. There you go, eat the fruit. Okay, um, we don't need the honey port. We'll open this one, see where this goes. I think it's just a shortcut back to the outside, but could be a secret. Yeah, there we go, shortcut to the outside. Okay, and we'll see if, um, oh. Hey, Ai, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, it's been, it's been a minute. Here, I hear him. You think there's anything out there? I don't think so. I don't want to risk it with the strange diamonds, so. You want to eat again? Nah, he doesn't. Okay, that's fine though. Um, it is it is going so well here. We just popped a Gordo. Now we need to go, we need to keep going towards this red side, all the way to the end where the butterfly Gordo is. And we need to start collecting nectar along the way. Oh, there's Taurus around. Calm down. Everybody calm down. We also need wild honey. I think this is buzzwax. Yeah. But we need wild honey, which is like the rarer of the two resources. So I guess we can collect them both, no big deal. Because we have five slots. So it's we need to go like this way and to the right. So I kinda went the wrong way here. Yeah, we need to go like up there. Here we go, this is this is the right way now. Yeah, and we need to be collecting any nectar we see on the way. Look at all these chickens. Totally forgot about Slime Rancher. Oh, I'm glad I could be a reminder for you. It is just the cutest game. How have you been? It's been a minute. Oh, I was like, uh, that pond just produced a plort. Okay, have we- this guy's asleep. Have we read this one? I used to start my mornings with a jog. Yeah, we did read that one. I don't think I've ever seen a puddle slime jump. Oh, that was cute. He just turned into a little ball. Oh man, not a huge fan of single player games, sadly, but it has a special place in your heart. Yeah. You know, I've been getting into Overwatch 2 recently. 
And that game, I have to say, is pretty fun. It's pretty fun. It's not really my genre, but it fills that void in my heart where, uh, where TF2 used to be. Because I played TF2 all the time. I, I played no, I played nothing but TF2. Oh, okay. You take two shots sometimes. Sometimes they take two. Sometimes they take one. It's kind of hard to tell which. That sounded like a lucky slime. How lucky could it be though? Okay, there was a nectar down there that we'll get. I see this buzz wax. Nectar here. We're gonna need so much nectar. Okay, might as well refill this. There's tars everywhere. There's more tar danger in this game than there was in the first game, for sure. Is this nectar? No, it's just a... It's weird that it appears as blue and then it like turns orange in your inventory. It's kind of cool, but... Okay, hopefully... Hopefully these guys don't eat nectar. I don't think anything eats nectar except the butterflies. Which, I mean, there are a lot around, so... We'll just do our best to collect as much as possible. Fortunately, it kind of falls to the ground and then rolls, and it's easy to see. But you're going extremely frustratingly. Um, you're trying to do something on GTA, it just says, timed out getting job data. I think you searched for the same height so many times, it doesn't work now, oh no. You broke the game for yourself. That's the worst. Oh, this guy, okay. So there was, there was something here. Hello, so we'll give you, um, oh no, wait, I need that, come back, that was the strange diamond, where, get out of here, so that guy can eat anything, but he only, he doesn't have a favorite, so we have to kind of feed, are you kidding me with the, with the tars, there's so many, okay, these guys will have eaten the nectar from here already, yeah, I was just clearing Tars out of here. Come on now. Okay. I don't see the nectar that was on the wall. Just stop. Just, just die. Just go away and never come back. Okay, here's another nectar. Good. We can get it before the butterflies eat it all. I know they'll be hungry, but that's okay. They're wild slimes. They, they can be a little hungry. You think there's like a secret nectar farm somewhere? Oh, there's one on top of that tree. That's kind of cool. Might as well get the buzzwax because we have so much. The other spot is reserved for... Not reserved, but it'll be for wild honey, so... Um, you search long and far on safari, but nothing works. It's definitely broken. Yeah. Um, you miss, you'll miss the worst paying heist in the game. Okay, yeah, guys, just, just, just calm it down. Okay. I don't really want to feed this guy until I have, until I have 25 nectar ready to go, though. Um, and then we'll probably unlock some kind of a secret. Oh man. Well, there's buzzwax up there. There's buzzwax there. I'm looking for wild honey. It's kind of, I remember it's on like the remote areas of the, of the map. Oh, we might as well max it out, I guess, while we're here. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, bonk. Thanks for the bonk bonk. Still just looking for more nectar, but can't turn down free buzzwax. I saw the stones over there. Oh, that's cool. That looks like a ghost ringtail. That's really cool. Oh, we already got that one. Okay, I think it's towards the tree. But we need to keep collecting, um, what's it called? Oh, we can stand here to get up here. Nice. Think there's a secret up here? It looks like there's something.
Nah, just a, just a way between the maps. Look, I'm Farah. You picked the heist you used to search for all day long three days, three times in a row. Now it's not giving it to you because you've searched it so many times. Okay, I need more water just in case Climbs want to sneak up on me. Oh, is there an error? Your uh, network is perfectly fine? Well, maybe yours is perfectly fine, but maybe theirs is not fine. Okay, well that's probably all the nectar that we're going to harvest for today. So, let's head back. We'll keep siloing it. And then we'll do some chores around the ranch, let things respawn out here. Um, we're still looking for a little bit of wild honey. So I think that's like, there was a bunch of it, like towards the big tree. But we'll go that direction. There's also some kind of secret with the large mushrooms. That the the logs were talking about. Wait, there might have been a rare honey here. Oh, hello, welcome back. Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Appreciate it. How do you reboot a router? You just some most of them you just unplug it and plug it back in. Like unplug it for 10 seconds and then plug it back in. Was there was there wild honey down here? I feel like there was something, some rare resource down here. We need a lot of wild honey though. Why are you angry? Why are you so angry? Okay, well, we're already collecting silky sand, and we needed some more of it. Seven's pretty nice. This is pretty remote. I'm surprised it's only silky sand out here and not the other one. The rarer one. Oh, treasure pod? I see you. Can't hide from me. Okay, but you can be inaccessible, apparently. You did that, but I didn't know how. You gotta go back to work? Alright, well, thank you. Wait, we had a Twitch baby. You're gonna have to remember our Twitch baby's name. I have too many Twitch babies now. And, and I'm a terrible Twitch father, and I have forgotten many of my Twitch baby's names. It's, it's a serious problem, not gonna lie. Actually, it's, it's a comical problem. <laughs> if it was a serious problem, I would do something about it. Hmm, I don't know what to tell you about the about the network errors then. It might be on their end, like like not not your internet. It could be either your internet provider, which there's not a lot you can do about that unless like you could call in and report something's down. Um or on oh, more buzzwax. Or it could be a problem with the GTA servers, because you know, sometimes they have problems. That was the log about the secret with the giant mushrooms. We're heading back towards this tree. I think we can go straight there from here. And there were a couple spots here that had the wild honey, so... We're oh, there's more nectar here! At least there's the nectar pods. There's one. There wasn't a nectar under this pod. There's not one in the pod either. Oh, there's another nectar. Okay, well this is good. This is really good. Glad we came over here. Okay, now, as for the honey, there's wild honey down there. Gotta go get that. Next to the... Oh, three. Amazing. Three is the dream. Yeah, that's Buzzwax, and we already got it. There was... I feel like there was more wild honey, like... Over that way. So let's try going... Oh, actually, we were just over that way. Maybe it's, um... Maybe it's, like, up here? I remembered it was, like, by one of these log things. But maybe I'm not remembering correctly. I don't see any up in the tree. Maybe there's some, like, down over this way? Potentially? Yeah, there's, there's a lot. Okay, so there's Buzzwax. There's wild honey under both of these sides. Another three. Let's go. A two. We'll take it. Two threes and a two. That's pretty good. I think we only needed eight. 
So we got it. And we have 11 nectar, which is really nice. So yeah, let's let's head back, deposit some of this. May oh, more wild honey. Even better. I mean, oh, get out of here. I'm harvesting honey. I'm making bees angry. I'm just looking out for more of it, you know? Oh, we're on the way back. I don't understand. Oh, we need a rock. We need a um, rock port. Are there any over here? Because there's a there was a rock guy over here. Yeah, there's one right there. Oh, but we're gonna have to. Okay, we'll leave the diamonds right here. We'll grab this rock port and then we'll go open this and then we'll come back for the diamonds. Which is, I know it's a risky play, because, you know, what if the diamonds despawn? We're going to immediately go back for the diamonds. I lost them already. Wait, where, for real, where were we? Hold up. I think we were this way. Yeah, okay. Oh, baby, that was close. Almost lost the diamonds. Why are there so many tars? Stop. Stop existing. You're a terror. You're awful. You're literally the worst and nobody likes you. It's okay if you bully Tars, because they're bullies. You can bully the bullies into not bullying anymore. Oh, hi. Joy? Oh, there's, you don't eat meat, okay. This is cool. I'm really digging this cave. A storage cell. Oh good, we can get the tank booster going. And this must have a door on the other side. Which, is that the door that we lost? I think this is the door that like, we had the port for it and we lost where the door was and couldn't find it again, ever. So, good to know that we can get in there from the other side though. Okay, and uh, we're just heading back now, which is up that way, so we'll head back up that way. Okay, land on the tree please, land on the tree. It's like the jetpack is uh, a little too boosty. There's something over there. I think that's where we're headed. No, we're going the complete opposite way that I thought. This way? Uh, also not the way that I thought. Where are we even headed? We're headed this way, okay. This way and then like to the left. But this is the strange diamond tunnel. We don't need to go that way. We need to go around this rock, right? Yeah, 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 okay. Up here, around the rock. See that treasure? Okay, we're leaving it. I was gonna say you can't hide from me, but apparently you can dodge. This is like not the right way we should be going. This is like gonna kill us. Oh man. We might max out on the buzzwax. Two more and we're maxed. And then I see two more right in front of- you know what? Stop. There was one note of the tar song. Just one note. Okay, now there's more. It was just like, uh, and then I got them, and then they were like, oh, okay, yeah, nah. We're, we're done tarring. Okay, is this still the right way? Kind of. I mean, it's really not the right way. When I say kind of, I mean not at all, usually. If I'm like, well, kind of, that means like, this is this is just insight into how I talk. And then you can call me out on it in the future. It, it's a way of saying like, not really. Like what you've told me isn't exactly true, but there's a maybe kind of a glimmer in there of the truth. And so I'll be like, well, kind of, and then I'll highlight the part that, like, we're talking about a difference. Um, and then I'll kind of fully expand on that. Okay, I see that tar there. Boom! Didn't even change the music. We are so good. Not, not really good. We just put enough hours into this game that I'm confident in playing it. It's this way. But it was not, in fact... Oh, it was this way! Let's go! I'm so excited when I just like pick the right way to go. The alternative would have just been to loop around and take three seconds longer. But I'm just so excited about this game. It's phenomenal. Okay, 
So we've got 10 honey, which is amazing. Two diamonds. Do we need 10 diamonds for that next upgrade? And we've got 30 buzzwet. Could you not be pushing me, please? I don't have any food for you. You know what? I need to take these guys and throw them into the ocean to be one with the great sea again. Okay, we have enough. Oh, we don't have enough deep brine. Um, oh, I just knocked my coffee cup. Time to cheers. And we'll put it back in front of me. Okay, tank guard we don't need. We need lava dust for that. The pulse wave we don't really need. Oh, we only needed two strange diamond. We need two more silky sand. We just put 30 in, didn't we? Oh no, it was something different that we did. Okay. We can definitely do the tank booster. 40 units in each tank. We need ringtail plorts, rock plorts we have. And we need two more silky sand. Um, and we need boom plorts. Do we have boom plorts somewhere? I think we do. But they eat odd onions. So it's not like a great, great setup. So, um, we won't get to do all of these today, but I think I'd like to go get more silky sand. I thought we just got a whole bunch of it, but maybe it was the buzzwax we got 30. Okay, so we need some boom plorts. We need some rock plorts. Let's go get the booms sorted. They are over this way. Okay, you guys get to be one with the sea again. Yeah, they made it. No, the boom plorts are in the cave. Is this the cave? I don't think this is... I think this is where we put the ringtail, guys. You fixed it! Oh, good job! Those guys... A couple of them are looking kind of hungry, so we'll feed them. Oh, I love the tank booster, too! That is my jam. Yeah, our chores are going to go so much faster now. Can't wait for tank booster 3. Okay, we'll take these guys out. And I can't wait for the, the sixth back tank, because that'll be amazing as well. So he did turn to stone. And, okay. I think I'm understanding how these guys work now. So you just feed them... Okay, there's a lot of pogo fruit in this zone, so let me, um... Let me collect all this pogo fruit, because those guys don't care what they eat. I've, I've got this. You feed them a ton. And they're only awake at night. But once they're done eating a ton of food... They get full, and then they won't put the plorts out. Like, they store up the plorts, and then when they're hungry, they release all the plorts again. So we're going to put this on slow mode, and we should eventually see 17 plorts over there. Um, and they do, those stone statues of the ringtails are ringtails during the day. So maybe I'll put a solar shield on this and it'll always be night. I didn't think I would need it, but I, I had no idea how these guys worked, right? Yeah, okay, interesting. Alright, maybe we'll do a manual once, because it says once they smile, stop feeding them. Oh wait, he just straight produced a plort. Uh, what? We fed him, when we first brought him back, we fed him so much, and he produced no plorts. Oh, now he's not producing plorts. Is it because- oh, it's because he has that sly grin, so he's full, so he won't produce plorts now. I get it, okay, wow. So he'll only produce plorts if he's hungry and you feed him. You wonder what the slimes taste like? They probably taste like slime. We needed three anyway, so that's perfect. So we'll get more ringtails uh, next time we go out at night to that zone. We do need some silky sand, so we'll go hit the beach over there eventually anyways. Um, these guys are gonna be hungry though. So I'll go I'll go dump the stuff that we have now into the research station. But let me feed these guys first. Okay. 27 mint mangoes, good stuff. 
We have seven in there, so we'll put seven. And I'll put the rest in the feeder. Okay, these are going into the research station. Might as well put the honey ones and the butterfly ones in there. We don't need money right now. If we ever need money in the future, I'll do off-screen grinding and get the money. I was like, what is that? It's mushrooms. Mushies. Okay, let's get some of these ports sorted. Oh, there's so many. We might need some hunter ports too, so um, I'll sell the honey ports and then I'll put the hunter ports down in the research thing. Uh, we'll go grab the puddle ports as well and we'll put those down in the research thing because I think we needed some more. And then also the rock ports, so we'll do some harvesting here. They do love their heartbeats. Are they going to be 39, or did some of them dry out? I think 39 might be the perfect harvest if you get it just at the right time. Okay, these guys are hungry as well. So we're going to put 8 in there, I guess. I guess that's fine. These need to go into the research station as well. Might as well put the angler ports down in there too. We'll probably need more. And we haven't needed more than 30 per upgrade, so I don't know that we'll need to put the rest in. Oh, good. I can't accidentally suck up a puddle slime because my inventory is full. That's convenient. I wish you could move the backpack slots around. For no other reason than not having to scroll an extra time every time I switch to 5. I guess you could just push the number key. I could just push the number key. In fact, I will. That's good advice. Thank you. Okay, so we should be looking good now. I, can we get the dash boots now? And we need boom ports as well, and lava dust. Okay. Um, we just need two silky sand. Two lava dust. Okay. Why does nobody know how to do a heist? Okay, so what is a heist in GTA? I've never played GTA. Or if I have, it was like one time at a friend's house, and I don't remember how to play. These guys are hungry, they're all going towards the food. This looks like a really full harvest as well. Even though some of them are turning to dust. Actually, they're not even hungry. So, these guys... Yeah, 39. Perfect harvest. They're killing the security for no reason and setting the alarms off. Oh, okay. Is it like a stealth kind of thing? Alright, we'll go put these in... We'll go put these in the research station. We should put a research link out here, right next to the... Well, if it's next to the market, we might as well go the extra steps down. We need to put a market link and a research link... A refinery link down in each of the, like, extra zones. But currently we haven't needed to, because we have less than four slots worth of stuff to take. Although, we can only carry 40, and a lot of times they go over, so... Maybe I'll see what I can fabricate. Um, utilities, so... Those are not... We need warp tech. Yeah, okay, so... A blue warp depot. Refinery link. Okay, we need deep brine for that. And a home portal would be nice. Interesting. I got so many decorations too. Uh, you know, I'm not so into the decorations until we get to end game. Okay, so everyone in here is sorted. Everyone over there is sorted. So let's go to the cave. These guys are going to be really hungry. Because I haven't really been able to get their food source up and running. Oh, they're so hungry. Okay. We're going to feed them all of the odd onions. Then we're going to put the carrots in the auto feeder. So they'll produce slowly over time, but at least they'll get 14 of their favorite food right now. Wow. So the odd onions grow in addition to the other stuff. Are we making slime soup, carrots, and onions? That's right. It's a boom sloop. A bo boom sloop. A boom soup. 
Is it so I is it better to go stealth then? Or is it better to go um, and just like take out all the guards first? I imagine it's better to go stealth, but English. I speak English. I do speak English, thank you very much. Oh, it's a giant mushy. Wait, which one are we auto feeding these guys? I forgot. Uh, Q-berries. What? And the okay, okay, my brain stopped working. It's a terrible thing. Wasting a mind is a terrible thing. When your brain stops working, it's a terrible thing. I don't know how the bats are not like empty on food now. Right? Also, this had more than 39. This had 40 plus two plus however many we just put in. 14, something like that. And they're full on floors. They're full, they're absolutely full. Okay, well we have no lack of phosphor and batty floors. We're gonna, we're gonna open this back up and it's gonna be like completely full. Ready? Boom. And there's still, oh, look at all the pile of stuff over there. We need a refinery link in here. I'm surprised you can't put anything up on this platform, but you know what, whatever. It's all good. Okay. I just stopped running for no reason. Must have fallen off a rock. Then we're gonna go see how many total nectar we have, because I think if we go out tomorrow, as in like, you know, today, but tomorrow in game, then we should be able to collect enough for the the big butterfly guy. And I think he's one of the endgame guys. So we'll have to see. Now is it the crystal I think the booms eat hens and the crystal slimes like the odd onions. So we're gonna have to get some meat going together. Okay, just need lava dust now. Perfect. And silky sand. Lava dust and silky sand, that's easy. Um, let's go this way. I think this is where I put the silo. It has all of the other nectar in it. I keep calling it nectar. Is it nectar? It is. Moondew nectar. Okay, 17. Yeah, so we can definitely go out. We can wait till daytime, and that should be a full 24-hour cycle. And we can go out and see if we can collect enough to pop that gordo. Um, and then that'll take us to the end of the episode. So let's sleep overnight. We'll check the phone. Oh, 12 hours. Yeah. Morning time, baby. Check our phone calls real quick. Victor, everyone called. Ah, Beatrix, I was cleaning out the lab and found this. Perhaps you have some use for it. I believe it's still in working order. You know what they say, one person's trash is another person's hastily issued gift. Enjoy. I agree, the spontaneity scares me too. Okay, blue home portal. Hey B, I found something I was gonna throw out, but then I thought, hey, B likes old junk I don't need. I bet she would just love this. You can thank me later. Okay. Uh, it's a gadget? Looks like a decoration. Hey Amiga, I got you a little gift. It's not homemade and it's not pie and it's not a homemade pie. But I thought you'd like it all the same. Shame about the pie though. Amber shrubs, okay. This is probably because we popped a gordo and made progress and now it's like going. Um, hiya B, how's life out there on the Rainbow Island? Gosh, it's even fun to say, it must be a hoot. You know, ever since I heard you were off doing something new, I got to thinking about my own life and what's the next new for me? Hobson and I have both seen and done so much in our lives, been one adventure after another across this dusty rock, and ever since we've become acquainted we haven't slowed down one bit. So we're looking to take a new adventure together, but we just haven't figured out what or where. Maybe we go exploring some hidden nook off the far, far range like you, or even set our sights to the stars like Hobson had done before. Whatever we decide to do, it'll be all the more special because we'll be sharing it this time with each other. It's that part that makes it all the more exciting. It's so hard to find someone in this world that fits you completely, such a rare thing, like finding two identical snowflakes in the desert. I know you feel that more than I can say. I ain't ever losing sight of just how lucky I am, B. I I want to use the gifts the universe has seen fit to give me. You keep your head up, girl. We'll chat again soon. Oh, she's so wholesome. Love the calls from Thora. Alright, we're going out. We're going to collect nectar and one more nectar run. And then pop that butterfly. And then I think that's that's all the time we're going to have for today.
Where is that refinery link? It's around here somewhere. So pretty. You're so pretty. That's entirely true. Oh, hey, come back here. I don't really need more jellystone, but we probably will in the future. I think Ninja is my identical snowflake in the desert. Okay, last time we went around this whole thing and it got really confusing. Let's do our best to make it a straight shot this time. Also, I'm gonna see if we end up passing that cave with the strange diamonds, I'm gonna check and see if there's any diamonds in there because those are really rare resources, so. I don't really remember where that cave was. I think it was like right here. Ah, okay, it's all good. He just died. Maybe the rock slimes took him out. I didn't even know they could, but I guess they do damage, so. Okay, we're on the blue side now. I guess we're just headed towards the end, so it's all good. I don't know if nectar grows out here on the blue side. Because the butterflies aren't out here, so. Can't imagine that there would be food, but no butterflies. We don't need buzz wax. We need sand, so I'll go down and get more sand from the bot. Oh, I ran the wrong way. Come on, this is why this is why I'm bad at games. I just do those ones for the money. Oh, I'm dead. With all the nectar. Well, that's a fitting end for the day. All right. Thank you guys for coming on by. If you're on YouTube, please like and subscribe. I would appreciate it, especially after losing all that nectar. But hopefully, as always, you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.